My name is Sydney, and I'm 13 years old. And I have a dream that in 40 years, I will be elected to become the Prime Minister of Canada. Once I am Prime Minister, a few global issues will instantly be addressed. First of all, kids trying to make a difference or light their spark will not be pushed aside, but rather encouraged to fulfill their calling. Because I know that children can make a difference. We aren't just fools to be made fun of. There are many examples of kids taking action, but my speech is based on one specific story. A nine-year-old girl went to a local clothing cupboard to volunteer for the morning. There, she met countless people searching for clothes to help them survive the winter. That was just two months away. But one man stood out in particular. His name was Richard, just an ordinary name. But his clothes, they were in tatters. A ripped t-shirt, shorts, and sandals in October? She was curious, concerned. She followed him down to the basement where the clothes were kept to watch. He took very little, but for everything he did take, he repeated, thank you, thank you, thank you. On the drive home, she thought about what had happened. And Richard, no human should have to live like that. She felt angry, passionate. She felt she had to do something. And that is what ignited her spark. And that is what started the Garden of Love. I am that girl. And Richard struck me so strongly. that I began fundraising and growing fruits and vegetables for a local women's shelter. Lots of kids do things that are similar, and they believe that it doesn't matter what age, size, or color you are. We are made to change the world. We are born with the spark inside of us, and it's our duty to light our sparks, turn them into a flame, and keep it going. That spark represents our passion, the issue that angers us the most. Once everyone's spark has been turned into a flame, then together we can approach the local and global issues and resolve them once and for all. Your spark, ignite it so that we can make a difference together. Look around you. There are thousands of empowered youth right here, right now. The power in this room is simply incredible because everyone believes that they can make a difference, and it's true. But, but one thing that we just have proved is that children are not just the future, they are the present, too. The people here. This is just the beginning. There are over one million empowered youth across the world. So you are not alone in this. We are in this together. Thank you.